Zippity doodah, beautiful day, great to be alive. Hey, what's up everyone? This is Chris Brown here again. As you can see, I'm filming to today, or should I say uh, tonight's video from Epcot Center. It's the World Showcase here in Epcot Center, and this is France. Now, over the past few videos or so, what we've been doing is we've been talking about uh, utilizing the money that our competition is spending in advertising, and you can use that money to be able to go get yourself more customers, right? So as you've seen in some of our previous videos, I'm not a big advocate of spending money in advertising. You know, if, if other businesses are spending this money in advertising and, and if they're going to let us use their advertising money to be able to get us more customers, why should we go out there and, and spend money in advertising, right? But for those of you who want to spend money in advertising to grow your businesses, um, what I'm going to do here in the next couple of minutes, I'm going to show you how you can broadcast your message to $2,500 2500 people uh, to 5,000 people or so for as little as five bucks. Now I know a lot of you are using some of the, the free websites there out there on the internet, uh, the, the Craigslist and things like that, but you're not exposing your message to the thousands of people that you're going to be able to expose your message to um, by what I'm going to show you here in the next few minutes. Um, so let me. what I'm going to do here now is I'm going to go ahead and take you to my computer. I'm going to show you how this works and we can broadcast our message to a couple of thousand people for as little as five bucks. So come on with me as I uh, go ahead and take you to my computer and I show you this. Okay, so uh, the tool that we're going to use to, to advertise our business is Facebook. Um, I'm sure most of you have a Facebook account or at least are familiar with it. But when it comes down to promoting our businesses, most of us are promoting it in the wrong way. And what most of us are doing is they're come over, coming over here to what, what is called as your Facebook wall. And basically you're just saying uh, either through text or through a picture, you're just basically saying buy my stuff. You know, of course, you'll run an ad a little bit, you know, more details than that but that's basically what you're saying right um the problem with that you still want to do that i'm not going to stop you doing that you still want to do that but the problem with that is even if you have 5,000 friends on facebook it really is not exposing your message to the proper amount of people to really get you the results that you want so you really want to do what is called as a boost your post so if you come over here to facebook Again, if you come over to your Facebook wall, generally within the first couple of listings, so if you scroll down the page here just a little bit, there's going to be what is called as a boost your post. And that's what this one is by Periscope. And as you can see, there's a like page and then, then the sign up button. And that's the, ad, that's the ad that they are running. And so we want to do the same thing, but in order to do that, we're going to need to have what is called as a fan page. So I'm going to take you over here to my fan page. I'm not going to spend some time explaining how to set up a fan page. You can get in contact with us or find some other resources and, and get a fan page set up. But that's really what, what we want to use here. Now, a lot of times, again, people will use the free resources. And a fan page is free, but again, it just really doesn't expose the, the uh, enough people that you really want. Um, most people are trying to get likes from their fan page and what I'd rather do is I'd rather build an email list and so that's what I do is I use Facebook to build an email list and that way I get to own my own media and you'll uh, own my own list okay so here's what we're gonna do here so um, as I scroll down the page here, you can see some of the listings that I've done or the posts that I've done on my Facebook page before. So again, as you can see here, I got 2,600 likes. Uh, but if you come down here, this last picture that I posted, I only it was only exposed to 10 people. So a very, very, very small percentage of people um, that you'll be exposed to. And that's why I don't really like to... Um, that's really why I don't like to use my fan page. I'd rather build an email list. But what I will do is I will do what is called as a boost my post to capture email leads or if you want to do this to get, get people to call you or however it is that you want to do this. So this is the picture that I'm going to use. I'm going to assume that you know how to post a, a picture on Facebook. 
I'm not that's real not really the, the purpose of this video um, I want to show you how to run an ad on Facebook so get a picture of some sort poke put it on Facebook and then what you want to do is you want to click on what says boost post so I'm going to go ahead and click on that it's going to take just a second or so for this to come up and and first of all you want to pick your audience uh, people who like your page, uh, people who like your page and their friends, uh, people you choose through targeting. And that's really what we want to go with. Now, I know a lot of you, again, are, are posting ads on, on Craigslist and things of that sort. And um, the problem with Craigslist is, is okay, but the problem with Craigslist is, is it's kind of like a generalization ad you know you really don't really target exactly the specific type of person that you want and you know I know I've seen a lot of you as business owners who are spending a lot of time po posting 10 15 ads a day if not more now some of you might be spending money to, to post those ads too but generally you're spending more money than five dollars okay and as you can see here you'll be able to expose 1,400 to 3,500 people for five dollars, and uh, you're also when you're posting ads on Craigslist, you're not targeting the, the specific and exact type of person that you want. So what you want to do here is you want to create a new audience. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that, and this way we get to really uh, target the the specific type of person that that we want. So we'll just say, I'll just call this um, sample, and then the countries, what, what country do I want to do it? I uh, can do it in states and providences. So let's just say I'm going to do it in Kissimmee, Flo so Florida. So you can target you know, specific areas that you want like that. And you know, and then you can do you know. So that's where I want it. Um, then what is the age range? Um, let's say I want to do it from age thirty, okay, to sixty-five. I'm gonna do. Uh, you can do both men and women, or you can just say men. And what interest do they have? Um, you know, you can really target this. I'm not going to really go into do two details, uh, but w one thing that's really helpful is to notice the type of cars that your customers drive. You know, ask them what kind of you know kind of survey your customers and kind of figure that out um, because the your customers the the type of cars that they drive really reflects the personality that they have okay so you can really uh, so you can type on drives what type of cars or some of the interests that they have and so you can really narrow this 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 customer down really really deeply let's say that they you want to target people who live on main street who his favorite color is the color blue, who makes $75,000 a year, whose favorite rock band is Van Halen or something like that. You can really target these people very narrowly and very detailed and targeted very sharply as compared to what you could do on, let's say, a Craigslist or something like that. So now we're going to go ahead and save that. And that is our, that is our audience. And then after we've done that, we're just going to go ahead and select boost our post. And it's submitting our information and then the next step is asking for our payment information and so we're only paying five bucks and so we would go ahead and select our credit card and then go ahead and continue that I'm not going to boost this post because again this was just as an example of this but again you're, you're here you're able to see how to target 1500 to 3000 people in your local community um, for as little as five bucks by using Facebook using what is it called as a booster post. So as you can see here Facebook is an, an enormous and an amazing way to be able to broadcast our marketing messages to our, our potential customers and to our potential clients but most people are doing it the wrong way. You know they're not really getting the exposure that they need however if we just uh, you know, spend about as much money for, you know, a value meal at McDonald's or something like that, we can expose our marketing message to thousands and thousands of people. And uh, so if you haven't done so already, if you want to go ahead and, and implement that, 
Um, uh, again, if you look down on the page below, you'll also be able to find out the full details about what we call as the unfair advantage marketing system. So if you're not going to go ahead and, and spend money in advertising using these methods with Facebook and stuff, uh, what we can do again is since you already have, uh, uh, there's already businesses that are already spending this money in advertising and we can turn that to one of your buyer's networks and we can uh, get them to, so they will refer those customers, customers to you and that way you can go ahead and grow your business. So if you look down below directly underneath this video, you'll find all the tools, everything that you need to be able to implement that method. But take care everyone, have a great day, and we'll see you in our next video. Bye bye now. Now I hope this information has been helpful. If you hey, I wanna invite you to order our free DVD. Now on that DVD, you will discover how to use the money that your competition is spending in advertising and how you can use that to get more business for yourself. Now the first time that I did this, one of my competitors was spending $100,000 a month in advertising. And I used that money to be able to get 141 sales for myself in the very first six hours that I did this. And I'll show you how you can go ahead and do the same thing as well. Now next you'll see how to harness the spending power of your customers who are spending money with other businesses and how you can use that to make 10 or 20 times more profits from your already existing customer base. So you have customers and those customers are buying things from other businesses, right? So we'll show you how to make money when your customers are buying from other local businesses or perhaps even online and that will enable you to make 10 to 20 times more profits from your already existing customer base. Then we'll reveal the secrets of what companies like Apple, Disney, McDonald's do to never pay out of pocket for their business expenses ever again and how you can go ahead and do the same thing. Then you'll see how to get companies to pay you in order for you to advertise your business and much, much, much more. So if you're on our website, if you look down below directly underneath this video, you'll find a little link that you can click on to order your free DVD. Otherwise, go visit freedvd.prostarprofits.com. Again, that's freedvd.prostarprofits.com. Again, I hope this information has been helpful. Take care, everyone. Have a great day, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye now.